Our back to school coverage continues with Gilbert Bays at Spring Lake Middle School in Cumberland County. And Gilbert, something new this year, weapons detection systems in schools. You know, Renee, that's right, but it's no no secret. Um, we knew that this was going to come about ever since Cumberland County School System got the approval to purchase the uh, security system for just about every school in the school system here in Cumberland County. Let me show you what it is. It's it's called Open Gate. It's a security system. It's one that's uh, used for security at several school systems and businesses across the country. Now, this system is non-invasive, which means students can walk through without having anyone touch them or search through their uh, book bags or anything like that with the exception of, of um, the uh, laptops that they have. Uh, it can detect weapons just like any other metal detector. It will be set up at entryways at school buildings for daily screenings, but the system is portable, which makes it easy to move to football fields and other events where large crowds are gathered around school campuses. Every high school, every middle school will have weapons detection and will have standards for our elementary schools. And we've worked collaboratively with our sheriff's department and all of our municipalities to provide school resource officers and uh, crossing yards uh, at our schools. You know, I talked with uh, Dr. Marvin Connolly just about 20 minutes ago, and he outlined some of the things that parents should be aware of when they come back to school. And one of the emphasis, again, is on the safety of students. And he says that this system, the open gate system, is just one tool to make sure that te teachers, students, and parents and administrators are safe as they comp uh, accomplish the mission of making sure that our kids are safe at schools. Reporting live here in Cumberland County, Gilbert Bays, WREL News.